We believe, as an industry, that in the next one year, the vast majority of programmers will be replaced by AI programmers. We also believe that within one year, you will have graduate level mathematicians that are at the tippy top of graduate math programs. So that's one year, okay? What happens in two years? Well, I've just told you about reasoning, and I've told you about programming, and I've told you about math. Programming plus math are the basis of sort of our whole digital world. So the evidence and the claims from the research groups in OpenAI and, and Anthropic and so forth is that they're now somewhere around 10 or 20 percent of the code that they're developing in their research programs is being generated by the computer. That's called recursive self-improvement is the technical term. So what happens when this thing starts to scale? Well, a lot. One way to say this is that within three to five years, we'll have what is called general intelligence, AGI, which can be defined as a system that is as smart as the smartest mathematician, physicist, you know, artist, writer, thinker, politician. I call this, by the way, the San Francisco consensus because everyone who believes this is in San Francisco. <laughs> it may be the water. What happens when every single one of us has the equivalent of the smartest human on every problem in our pocket. But the reason I want, to, I want to make the point here is that in the next year or two, this foundation is being locked in and it's not, we're not going to stop it. It gets much more interesting after that. Because remember, the computers are now doing self-improvement. They're learning how to plan and they don't have to listen to us anymore. We call that superintelligence, or ASI, artificial superintelligence. And this is the theory that there will be computers that are smarter than the sum of humans. The San Francisco consensus is this occurs within six years, just based on scaling. This path is not understood in our society. There's no language for what happens with the arrival of this. That's why it's underhyped. People do not understand what happens when you have intelligence at this level, which is largely free.